Hello? How you doing? Good, how are you? How you like the 10th? It's good. Uh, I missed 50 a little bit. The 10's good too. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I just uh, wanted to try it out for protective reasonings, and uh, I think it's a good idea as a quarterback uh, just have that on your left front knee. So I'm gonna give it a go and see how it feels. It's pretty good. Yeah, I'm getting a different one. So tomorrow, just try some different things. Like uh, Thursday night, you might have taken a shot to the leg. Does it have anything to do with that? Oh no, no. Yeah, I feel good. Um, you know, practice is practice, and they stay off the quarterback, so everything's good. I just want to make sure. I keep it safe, and that's the you know your lead leg when you plant. So you just want to keep it safe. Would you say it's been an adjustment for you? What NFL open receiver is versus what it was in college? Um. Yeah, I mean football is hitting the open guy, so whoever's open, give him the ball. And there's sometimes today I threw the ball when I shouldn't have, but we wanted to push the ball down the field, and it's all about taking the shots at the right time. And these guys are open on a lot of the plays. Um, so, like I said, it's football, and the quarterback's job is to hit them when they get open, and they've been doing a good job of that, and we've had really good time on our protection, too. So, you feel like you can take some more chances in practice and maybe just see what you can get away with, kind of? Um, not really. Practice is just like the game, so just kind of stick to your rule. If it's like a deeper play, then yeah, go for it. But um, to me, just moving the ball, and that's kind of our MO, is just positive plays. and. Uh, take the shots when they're there, so we can definitely do that better, and we will. Mac, how much of an adjustment was there from the practice to going to the game on Thursday night in terms of the speed and sort of processing quicker and getting rid of the ball quicker and getting your clock right? Yeah, I think I could uh, actually slow down a little bit and just take it in and um, just stick to my rules. I didn't feel like I was like out of place or anything, and everyone did a good job of just listening in the huddle and staying on the same page. That's what it's all about. It takes 11 people. It's not just me, obviously, and they did a great job, and obviously we'll get better. I felt like I left a lot of plays on the field. Um, it's hard to watch the film sometimes, but you got to just take it for what it's worth and then tell the guys, my bad, and keep moving forward. Do you feel like today's experience might be as productive and, and valuable as what you did Thursday? Um, yeah, today was cool. I think just changing the atmosphere and then coming out here, obviously they're going to give us some more different looks and stuff out here. So that was cool, but um, games are obviously always the most fun, and uh, yeah, so we're just trying to practice. Yeah, it was a good practice. They, they played well. We played well. So it was actually fun, and it's my first one, and we got one tomorrow. So it's, we're already moving on to the next I, one. I want to follow on Evan's question about open. Do you have to reconfigure what your definition of open is in the NFL? Um, the yeah, a little bit. I mean, in the NFL, it's everything's tighter. In high school, you know, guys open by four feet or whatever. College, it shrinks a little. And then NFL, it shrinks even more. So, I, I mean, that's just a fact. Um, and yeah, I just gotta read read the defense. It's more about getting the ball to the right spot, especially versus zone. Um, but man to man, you gotta kind of put it in there sometimes. So uh, yeah. Yeah, I um, yeah, it was cool to talk with them. Obviously, you know, that was kind of the past, and they were great teammates. But it was good to see them out here. And um, I think, like I said, it was a good, clean practice, and uh, it was a lot of fun for my first time. And I think they had fun. I wish they were out there, but you know. Um, you know, they did it the right thing every time and uh, just tried to have my back and I had their back and they led by example. What's up, KB? <laughs> um, but yeah, they're, they're good people and um, it was cool to see them today. Matt, how do you, how do you go about blocking out the noise from maybe people saying you're doing so well or people saying you're not doing so well? Um, I, I don't really look at anything like that's the best way to do it, honestly. Uh, just take the feedback from my coaches and my, my parents or whoever uh, that I trust and then kind of go from there but I know most of the times when it was good and most of the times when it was bad but at the end of the day you just gotta stay even keeled and keep working because it's not going to be perfect every time. Mac is being named the opening day starter a goal of yours? Um, for me honestly I've always you know just been blessed to be a part of a team and you never know when your time's going to come so I'm just ready to uh, keep working obviously I have a lot of work to do and that's very clear but I'm going to keep working every day and uh, everything will just work out how it's supposed to play out. Matt, kind of a rough start to that last two-minute drill. Yeah. But then you finished throwing with that to pass Nick Heal. How important was it to kind of shake off those first passes and end on a good note? Um, yeah, I think with two minutes, you just got to like slot the plays and uh, take it one by one and don't worry about the last play, don't worry about the next play. And, you know, sometimes uh, you can score on fourth and ten or whatever, so you always have one down left. 
Um, but I got to do a better job just taking the ball to the to the right guy. Perfect. Thanks, guys.